is a potential new solution to some storage uh, for posters. Um, there's been a lot of chat going on some of the groups lately, and this is hopefully um, partially a solution. So this is what just came in today from Bags Unlimited. And this is backing boards. Sorry if this is kind of not that great because I'm trying to do this by myself. But anyway, let's throw it up here and see what we got. Actually came packaged pretty good. I know there was a complaint from somebody in the chat rooms about how they basically just threw the boards into the big box, but this is not the case here. Okay, so this is what we get. This was the top sheet. As you can see, it's uh, cardboard on the back. Well, I mean, it's cardboard anyway, but it's white on the front. That looks like it's just a protective piece. These are the ones oops, that I actually purchased, which are white on either side. You can see how thick they are. So you get one of these on either side of this, and then I ordered 10 of these. Uh, it did come with a little bit of a ding down here. Hopefully that won't make too much of an issue on the posters. And I'm gonna put some of these together and show you what it looks like. Okay, as you can see, I have my first poster in, Django. And I use the Mylar sheets, also from Bags Unlimited, that I had. I got about a dozen of these. And I think it's gonna work out pretty good because it's relatively rigid. I can turn it without much of an issue. The problem I had before was when you have them just in these Mylar sheets and you try to take them out of the flat file, then they tend to ripple a little bit as you're holding them. This way I think it's gonna be much better solution. And as you can see, I'm gonna be able to do two posters. And there's the Day of the Dead folded in here. I think this is gonna be nice too because once there's a bunch stacked on top, it'll really help get rid of these folds for long-term storage. Okay, I got another shipment from Bags Unlimited. This is uh, backer boards. Hey, Robert. Backer boards uh, for some poster storage. I'm a little concerned because uh, it's got a big rip here. It's got a big bend, as you can see. Uh, and there's nowhere on here that says do not bend or anything like that. Um, not on the back either, which you really can't see, but I'm kind of showing you. So we'll see. Hopefully this is in better shape. I did get some from them before, and it was in a much different uh, package, uh, much thicker, which I think is in this video as well. Yes, it is. And you'll see the big difference. So hopefully these are better. I'm going to open it now and have a look. I also like to have these things on camera in case it's not in good shape because then I can show them that it's not in good shape. All right, here they are. Um, yeah, that's not good. Looks like it's got wet or damaged or something. This is not good packaging, unfortunately. 
So I will, yeah, this whole corner too. Look at them all. God dang it. Somebody else had mentioned that they had an issue with these guys in their packaging. And this is the bigger one. So I got some insert size right here. And it looks like pretty much all of these insert ones are, are not good. There's issues with all of them. And these other ones are the one sheet. So let's see what this looks like. Um, this side is all right. It's, it's a little bit dented. Some of these are pretty good. There's a, a few of them that, a few of them that are ripped or dented. Actually quite a few of them. What about this side? This side, same thing. Like all the corners are all dinged up which I don't know what that's gonna do to my posters. I don't want my posters to be laying on that. <sighs> Very disappointed. So I'm also noticing as I put these over here on this table to unbox the Mylar, there's only 10 of these. And I ordered 25. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I guess 11. And then the, no, that's right, 10, because the back of these two are the shipping ones. Arr. Okay, round two of Bags Unlimited. So if you've seen the first part of this video, you have seen that I did not have good luck. This is them finally getting back to me uh, and sending me some new backers. So this time they did a better job. They actually have Do Not Bend and Fragili Handle With Care which they didn't have before. This packaging looks so far a lot better. A lot less damage, there's a little bit of damage, but not too bad. So I put in my complaint, I put in my video to say that I was not happy of all of the issues. It took about almost a week for somebody to get back to me. And then it took at least another week for them to say that they saw the video, it's unacceptable, and they're gonna send out some new stuff. So here we are, about two weeks, two and a half weeks, actually later, and uh, let's see what all this looks like. Again, looking much better. Looks like it, you know, how it probably should be. See the corners are nice and double, double, uh, you know, whatever, sturdy. Strengthened. Strengthened, thank you. So uh, these, these corners were certainly not on the first one. So clearly, and it makes no sense because the amount of time and money that it takes to, for them to do this, they don't have to worry about, you know, sending out all new stuff again if it gets ruined. I mean, for crying out loud, their business is packaging, <laughs> right? you think that they'd be able to package the stuff that they're sending out. Yes, I sound a little jaded because I am. I have my Wu-Man crystal, wu -Man in the camera this time, so that way you can get a good shot of everything. The last video that you saw of me Obviously wasn't that great because it was just me trying to do it and hold it. So I needed some help. So, sorry it's taking a while, but I needed to use this 
and I wanted to get it from start to finish in case it's ruined again. Mm. All right. Here are the inserts. So far, so good. These look nice. So far. They're down here. Let's just take a quick look. Wow, see, that's how it's supposed to look, folks. Look at those corners. Those corners are nice all the way around. Yes, all the way around. Thank gosh. All right, I'll put these aside and let's check out. So the other issue that I had with the first shipment was I ordered 25 of these and they only sent me 10. But this definitely looks like 25 this time. Might even be more than that. <laughs> But these corners look pretty good. There's a tiny bit of damage on this side, but I'm not gonna bitch too much. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. A little bit of a little bit of damage on that side. That, but oh shit, this side's a little worse. Doesn't look like all of them, but you can definitely see. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's probably still usable, but it's still a pain in my ass that the shipping company, the packaging company, can't get. I'm just checking out the other corners. I want to make sure they're not ruined before I close off the video. Those look, those look good. Those are nice corners. And those look like nice corners. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's it. I would have been happy if they would have maybe, I don't know, sent me a little something for my trouble. Uh, you know, gift certificate or, you know, I don't know, something. Because it took two and a half weeks for them to finally get me the proper stuff. Anyway, uh, that's my review of Bags Unlimited. Subscribe. So this is the other issue that I have. This poster is all the way down. There's like an eighth of an inch that it goes over at the top. And you can see that this poster is as far down as it can go, especially with a backer board. And it's only like an eighth of an inch. Give us at least a quarter or, or a half inch, man. Jeez.